Well, KPRC Local 2 has been helping get you and your family ready for hurricane season. Right now, we want to pass along some information that will help you rebuild after that next storm if we need to. Here with me now this morning, John Eitman from Shepherd Construction and Roofing and also Brian Slay from Southern Shingles. Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Thanks Good morning. for coming in. Uh, John, let me start with you first mm -hmm. of all because I'm talking about roofing. I mean, even just a, a, a pretty bad rainstorm, some people report scams and things like that, people knocking on their doors. So what do we need to look out for as homeowners? Well, a few things you want to look out for mm -hmm. homeowners is like some of the stuff we have here on the table, Anybody can go to a Southern Shingles distributor or another distributorship and pick these items up at their front doors and come and knock on your door and show you these things and you would think they're a legitimate roofer. Okay. Yeah. But what you want to look at is look for their um, symbols from their uh, manufacturer. Okay. That they're a select shingle roofer. See that they're on the Better Business Bureau. Check their references. Mm -hmm. Check their websites check their testimonials. Um, and this is important too, right? That little seal that we were just absolutely. looking at? What uh, is this? This right here is with, uh, that is stating that I'm, that the company and us are select shingle roofers by certainty. Certified we have by the manufacturer. Okay. Certified yeah. by the manufacturer. We've all taken a test to become certified roofers. And that's the really important thing too, that's is right. that uh, you have to check credentials. And, and Brian, that's another thing. You guys work in tandem together. Right. But um, this is something that, that people really need to pay attention to. Oh, definitely. And well, you know, we just came through Ike. That was a year and a half of mm -hmm. everybody in the world becoming a roofer. And that's one of the issues in Houston specifically. There, there's no qualification to be a roofer. I mean, you saw a lot of plumbing trucks and a lot of electrical trucks all of a sudden become roofers because there was a need for it. But I'll tell you, one of the best tools in a toolbox for a homeowner uh -huh. is to check the ties that a roofer has to a community. People that use this as a, as a fallback career, and, 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 and not begrudging them at all, but there are differences between a legitimate roofer, a guy that's out there doing this day in and day out, versus a guy that might, or, or, or family that might go out there and do this from time to time. Look for their ties. People that are a true roofer in Houston, Texas, tends to treat it like a business. Mm -hmm. And most businesses sponsor their local, you know, chapter at, at different events. Baseball. Uh, baseball right. And this is where churches. references really yeah. would come into play. Oh, absolutely. Sure. Absolutely, without a doubt. And another thing, you know, just because Ike was a, almost two years ago, here recently in the past few months, we've had several storms that have gone through yeah. the Houston Gulf oh, yeah. Coast area where if you have shingles missing on your roof right now, just a few or uh, what we call in the business uh, shingles and courses that are lifted, mm -hmm. get hold of a certified roofer, general contractor that is certified and have them come out and look at your roof. Yeah. It's a free inspection. Have them look at because you could be eligible for a new roof through your insurance company. And yeah. this is preventative. This is it's good stuff to do now. Yeah, don't wait till the, the storm comes. Don't, wait, exactly don't right. wait till, they're, till yeah. they say, we've got a hurricane coming yeah. up yeah. I-45 or Highway 36. Got to <laughs> do it. Work with insurance companies, also mm -hmm. company insured. Those are other things to look for in a review mm -hmm. of this important information that we're sharing with you. And also to watch this interview again, a replay. It's all under the hot button for you on clicktohouston.com. Gentlemen, thanks for coming in. Thank we you. appreciate Thank it. You. Great information. Appreciate it. Thanks.